Robin Hood is a heroic outlaw in English folklore. He was a highly skilled archer and swordsman, and often used cleverness and wit to outsmart Prince John and the Sheriff of Nottingham. He has become known for robbing from the rich and giving to the poor. However, Robin Hood was actually stealing from an oppressive government that had taxed its citizens into poverty. He was simply returning the wealth back to its rightful owners. A modern form of Robin Hooding has once again begun in Keene. Liberty activists are attempting to save the townspeople of Keene from the oppressive parking tariff by paying the meters before parking enforcement officers can write a ticket on the expired meter. Saved. Saved. <laughs> I think this one's expired. You gonna write a ticket for this vehicle? <laughs> As long as you have something intelligent to say, yeah. I'm willing to listen. I have a problem with initiatory force. I think that violence is like not a good way to solve problems. And what I see government as is a thing that just uses violence to accomplish all of its goals. You being the agent of the government, uh, therefore puts your line of work uh, in in direct objection to my uh, moral sensibilities. So I try to make your life sort of difficult in order to discourage your bad behavior. That's what I do. <laughs> okay. And that's an honest description of what it is that I'm doing. And I know that that seems silly to you, right? But if someone doesn't pay the ticket that you write them, like what happens? Somebody, the fine goes up. And if the fine goes up a little bit more, and then over time, what happens is you steal their car, right? that you by force take their vehicle from them without their consent. And then they have to pay you to get the vehicle back. That is really the same thing as if I say any number of things is the reason that I, you know, take your meter off of you or do some violent theft thing to you. I think that that's morally wrong. And that's why I'm out here doing this. That's awesome. Well, thanks, for, thanks for talking to I'm, us. I'm the, glad uh, that you actually have something intelligent to say. Yeah, go those oh, thank you, thank sir. You, sir. <laughs> thank you. See, it's not just Ian's minions. The I appreciate it. Like what doing and wants us to Have a great day. You too, thank you. Oh, here's so, one. I'm sorry for every day that we disappoint. Boop, boop. We should be there more frequently. See, six minutes. It's a save. Up, oh, save. You got it for me? Yep. Thank you. We'll put a nickel in here. one's expired, but we're going to help you. Hey, good job! <laughs> yeah, we'll give you a card. You can... Robin Hood men in tight. <laughs> Fred's going to follow you, and we have the radio. So we're going to follow you wherever you go. You're not going to get away with it today. Champagne there. Wait, no. Is she going to use a blinker? 
No, she didn't stop. She didn't use her blinkers. She roll through. <laughs> Let's see if she comes to a complete stop. Oh, she did. No. 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 <laughs> California roll. And we're not talking about sushi either. Let's look at our look around line. <laughs> this one right here. She's on the telephone. She's like, yep, they're in the parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, they're right behind me now. <laughs>